Hey guys, down here at Myrtle Beach Travel Park this weekend, camping out. Actually, this is our last full day. We'll be leaving early in the morning, and I hate to do that. Love this place, but uh, we actually rented one of their trailers. You can probably see them behind me, the Salem uh, campers, and they're really nice. But uh, we pulled our camping trailer down here just to haul our gear, all our chairs and floats and all our, all our beach stuff. So uh, we just didn't have room for it in the van, and we pulled this thing pretty much every time we go on vacation unless it's just my wife and I so um, one question I had was about the speed on the tires and uh, let me show you these tires right quick okay so this is my spare tire and it's one of the ones that originally came on the trailer and you see here it says warning maximum 55 miles an hour the load rating on this one is 785 pounds so that's that's the one I kept as a spare I upgraded these last year and these particular tires here same wheels shows 55 miles an hour but uh, the load rating is uh, let me see 1250 pounds it's upside down if you can see that there's 1250 pounds so uh, quite a bit more of a load it will haul now I haven't upgraded the axle or the springs I'm gonna do that later so I've exceeded the 55 miles an hour. I've been up to about 70 uh, in the 70 mile an hour speed limit there on, I believe it was 485 and wherever it's 70, I've, I've hit that. Um, I don't like to travel at that, that speed for too long a period of time, but I have hit that. I push the limits on it. It does great. And um, I feel much better with it, much more comfortable with the new tires. Uh, I didn't, didn't really feel that comfortable with the old tires. But let me show you the miles we added up earlier and uh, this is the places we've been. And actually, it's pretty cool. I decided to have my wife, because you wouldn't be able to read my writing, I had my wife write the locations we've taken this, all our vacations, on the inside of this lid here on the uh, trailer. Check this out. Okay, so you know this is the front of the trailer, and uh, that's my little battery area. Okay, now this is the places we've been with it. July of 2013 was the first place we took it, Smoke Mont Campground in the Great Smoky Mountains. Now, that was before I actually built the trailer as it is right now uh, at the time it just had some side rails uh, some like one before side rails all the way around it uh, it actually worked really good but uh, nothing was dry and we had to keep it covered up with the tarp now the second time in 2014 uh, it was built that was the first place we took it after the uh, build and you see there's 201.9 miles and that's one way all these are one way uh, Dan Nicholas Park in Salisbury North Carolina again in Smoke Mott Myrtle Beach that's actually Myrtle Beach Travel Park here where I'm at now Tennessee that is Tremont Camping Resort in Townsend Tennessee Cane Creek that's down in Union County North Carolina and then again uh, this time at Myrtle Beach Travel Park all right, so that's all the places we've had this thing, and the distance total, and that's including taking it home, I have, which I haven't done this time, but it's uh, 2,498.6 minus the 158.6. So that's, uh, that's quite a few miles on this little Harbor Freight 4x8 camping trailer. Again, I have upgraded the tires. I'm soon going to upgrade the axle springs and the tires again. I'm wanting to go to 13-inch tires. I want to go to something that I'm not worried about the load or the speed and uh, we're going to Missouri in June. I don't know if we're going to pull this thing to Missouri or not, but uh, if we do, hopefully by then, I will have the new axle and tires and everything. And I'm also hoping to go to some aluminum wheels, so I don't know. I may have said that before, we just haven't gotten around to that yet. But uh, 2,498 miles, that's not bad for a little Harbor Freight 4x8 camping trailer. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Now guys have a good weekend.